Street said you've been kicking it with some chicks in Atlanta. Oh, yeah. I heard that too. No. Yeah. Are you coming in town and dipping around? I mean, it's a little awkward because. He did lightweight try to talk to me. What? Yeah. Street said you've been kicking it with some chicks in Atlanta. Child, now he was already cheating. And he been trying to holler at Kenya. Street said you've been kicking it with some chicks. Kenya said he tried to holler at me, girl. <laughs> Honestly, I definitely think this is what sparked them getting into that altercation at they assigned your Richard Ross and them party. Y'all remember that? When they got into it? Mm-hmm. 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 Yeah. Mm-hmm. I believe Kenya. I believe Kenya. I'm sorry. Were we supposed to not believe Kenya in this situation? Did y'all really think did y'all really think that Kenya didn't that, that Kenya was lying? Girl, Kenya wasn't lying. I'm also wondering, who was it that Candy said Martel came with the cameras at her restaurant? Who was that? Like I said, if they like you or think you cute, they will defend you. King Vaughn, for example. Child, that is so true. Because his daddy was nice looking, he nice looking, and he's a psychopath. And y'all let that nigga kill everybody. <laughs> Y'all was out there letting him just live reckless in these Twitter streets and on the regular streets, okay? I hate the fact that it took somebody out the country to connect the fucking dots for y'all. It's sad. Um, it was P it was the PR firm for me. I was like, child, they must have got an eye eyeball full of smoke that they didn't want, nor could handle. That's what I was thinking. That's what I was thinking. Didn't Candy say he was at her restaurant? Yes, holla at her cousin employee, somebody. Yes. He, he came in there with cameras and everything. She said he tried to bring cameras in there, something like that. Martel can't stand a woman pulling his car. Nope. And I bet you he got put on blast. Y'all think it was can Candy Cousin? Girl, I hope it wasn't Agbar V. Who was it? <laughs> Who was it? I believe Kenya, though. He probably got with Sheree because she was the most uh pliant. She was easy pickings. I ain't going to say you're wrong when you're right. Uh, Martel is shysty and very manipulative. He definitely got ulterior motives. I believe Kenya 100%. I do too. I do too. Yes, girl. Y'all let y'all let King Vaughn kill up the community, girl. Yes, y'all did. So y'all was acting a fool because um, Chance the Rapper was out here enjoying himself for the Jamaican for Jamaican Carnival, right? And y'all was real upset about it, girl. They was like, "You got a wife." Okay, and so Messy BB says, yikes, looks like Chance the Rapper's wife, Kirsten Corley Bennett, got something to say. She shared thought-provoking quotes about awareness and growth after a video emerged showing Chance the Rapper dancing with another woman. It was several women during Carnival. What happens in most people's, um, what happens is most people get older. The quote began, they honor their credit cards, they find parking spaces, they marry, they have the nerve to have children, but they don't grow up. Not really. Another message talked about how awareness is growth, detailing the importance of mindfulness and choosing new actions that will help rewrite uh, behavioral patterns. So he be cheating. So you, so he be cheating and you thought he had gathered himself and he has not, he has done no such thing. He has done no such thing. He has not gathered himself at all. Um, so me personally, I don't understand why she wasn't at carnival with him, but I wouldn't have, I'm sorry. Like I wouldn't have been bothered. I also feel like I use, I, I'm, I'm a little toxic. I, I would like to use opportunities like that. If you want to make me jealous by putting your meat on girls booties, you know, in Jamaica at carnival, just wait on it. You're going to have to pay for that later. <laughs> You're going to have to pay for that later. I ain't going to make no big deal about it. You know what I'm saying? Cause personally it's not that big of a deal. Like he dancing. It's not that big of a deal. Y'all it's Jamaica. That's what they do. It's carnival. You supposed to be dancing. Okay. Have y'all not seen that? Um, that's how they be okay but 
this is what she said. When she said most people don't grow up, it's too damn difficult. What happens is most people get older. That's the truth of it. They honor their credit cards. They find parking spaces. They marry. They have the nerve to have children, but they don't grow up. Not really. They get older, but to grow up costs the earth, the earth. It means you take responsibility for the time you take up for the space you occupy. It's serious business. I agree, girl. Awareness is growth. Noticing that something is holding you back and deciding to change is a huge step forward. It's like finding a a light switch in a dark room from there it's about being mindful choosing new actions in the present and patiently re rewriting your uh, behavior patterns i wouldn't have been tripping about this but i'm a different type of person i do realize that a lot of women that would have been tripping about this and if your husband got a problem i mean if your wife has a problem with you doing this then you probably shouldn't have been out there doing this to be honest but i also feel like y'all was together since high school girl y'all need to break up anyway like I feel like haven't they been together for a real long time? I want them to break up because it feel like he out here living his best life and you at home. That's what it feel like. It feel like he living his best life and you at home. Y'all see she ain't, she says she ain't care about being disrespectful in the chat, right? Blocks. Who? What happened? Who said that? <laughs> Why you ain't let me go off? It's all right. <laughs> it's giving they have an open marriage communication. And she only says something because everyone else noticed. You think so? Because he giving a little childish. Like when Jacques poured that liquor on Pooh's ass. Child. I just can't let husband get winded on that carnival. Because I'm not letting another nigga behind me. I'm too territorial. And you know what? Good for you, Yaya. Do what you got to do, girl. I'm married and I wouldn't be mad. You're supposed to enjoy yourself because I know damn well I would. Crystal, you and I are the same. <laughs> no, y'all, that's Olivia. Olivia and Juvia are in a, in a kennel together. And so that means he probably aggravating her. Couldn't be me. I'm going to be outside too. And that's me. Uh-oh, uh somebody got blocked. <laughs> Uh-oh. Okay, listen. Thank you. I do not believe in puppy love. That lady needs to have more experiences. And that's what I'm thinking. And that's what I was thinking when they got married. Um, carnival, it really shouldn't be a big deal. I don't think it is, y'all. I don't think what he did was a big deal. And I would hope that she didn't think it's a big deal. But if she does, it's probably because you have expectations for yourself that you don't have for him. And whenever there's an imbalance like that, that's going to eventually come to a head. But I also feel like, you know, you married him because he was doing well, girl. It was a smart thing to do. Don't get me wrong. But it also probably locked you in to be inside while he's outside. <laughs> and I would be outside if I was her. Okay? You ain't about to be grinding on hoes at, at Jamaican Carnival. And I'm not going to be grinding on hoes at Jamaican Carnival. Okay? Let me see. Is there anything else that I wanted to talk about before I get... Girl, yes. <laughs> girl, listen. So let's just, we're going to listen to it and then we're going to comment. The little ones, y'all, they, they don't be knowing. They be asking us to with us. Like, <laughs> sure. I'm about to look the shit out of your daddy. Like, <laughs> like, daddy, can we sit with the bed with you, daddy? Nope. He'd be like, ask Miss Jazz. I'd be like, mm -hmm. it'd be the little So she's still with Cam, huh? She's still over there have, having uh, painful anal sex with Cam and crying in the shower. <laughs> And he's still writing messages and hieroglyphics and shit. Oh, my God. The fact that he probably paid for this font is why it's so aggravating to me, y'all. Um, I feel weird sleeping in the bed with someone else's children. Well, that's you. I agree with him on that. That's you. Everybody don't have to be worried about, you know, because I used to sleep in the bed with my auntie and my uncle all the time. The fuck? <laughs> Nothing ever happened. <laughs> Everybody slept. Okay, it's my family. Like everybody don't have to worry about their family members doing shit to them. Okay, um or whatever. And then somebody said, I don't get it. Seven kids and you have zero. Um, no, child. I love when women be flipping this shit on on men because men always talking that shit about women. So I love when women be like, Oh my god, <laughs> you have how many children and you want me to be with you? <laughs> Why? <laughs> I love it. Anyway, he said, Well, that's why I ain't with you. It's levels to this queen. And if someone is worth it, your ass would do a lot of things. Once you say, and what makes you worth it, Cam? Because you got a lot of money. Because the way she explains y'all relationship sounds 
just as dusty as a relationship with a nigga with not as much money. Girl, the painful ain't no sex crying in the shower did it for me. Um, I would hate for anyone to go through life alone. I would hate it there. Oh, my God. I just kind of feel like the fact that you even in the comments arguing with people because they say something about, you know, her relationship with you. Like, <laughs> OK, look, I think it was some more. Uh, what else? I see Cam in the comments. <laughs> Child, he is in the comments. Yeah, he commenting some people. Okay, wondering how many dudes be trying to fuck her on the road. Okay, okay, okay. I bet Toya turn up busting it open, though. Child, I guess. Their relationship makes me feel uncomfortable. I'm going to just tell y'all the truth. I don't know them people, but based on the shit that Jazzy said... And also based on the person we understood Jazzy to be and then the shit she then went and said in that interview. Um, yeah. Yeah, girl, I, 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 I don't know what's going on over there, but mm, I'm, 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 I'm worried for you, girl. But, you know, have fun. I'm, I'm glad you happy. As long as you happy, girl, as long as you happy. Okay. Um, anyway, hold up. Why are y'all talking about Marcus Houston? What? He's being real passive saying queen. Oh yeah, y'all know queen mean bitch. <laughs> it's the, it's the, it's the respectful way of calling a woman a bitch. Uh, yeah, okay, queen. <laughs> oh my God. Funny how Cam assumes she is alone because she don't want his seven kids. That is funny. They love to use that alone shit like it's a bullet or something. Uh, yeah, when she shared that, it was disturbing. She basically caved all the way in for money. That's what it seemed like. The complete 180 she did is very scary. Yes, I agree. We all agree. It was weird what she did, and it feels really uncomfortable. And anytime we find out that y'all still together, we like, oh, y'all still together. You still okay, y'all, right? Okay. <laughs> child to me it ain't even the seven kids or the baby mama it's 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 cam like to me cam doesn't cam seems to do what he does so that he will have a reason to do you however you want he want to do you and i feel like they're in a they're in a dom sub relationship probably so that probably works for them i just didn't know that's what she was on but to each his own to each his own but it just don't feel right, y'all. It, it don't feel like love and respect. It don't. It feel like I'm paying you so I can do whatever I want to do to you. And you so happy to have me paying you and having me be who I am. And I'm probably good at the things I do do that are good. Got your head gone, bitch. <laughs> Got you, bitch. <laughs> 